Hey guys, Dawnwing Sekrozma is finally available for everyone during Global Go Fest in Pokemon Go. And we'll go over complete raid details, its rankings, top counters, and everything you need to know in this video. But before that, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more such videos. It will be in tier 5 raids on July 14th from 10 am to 6 pm local time. It has a max CP of 4634 and takes double super effective damage from ghost and dark type raid counters in game. We will get Necrozma in counter once we beat it and get fusion energy from these raids. Later we can fuse Necrozma with Lunala to get Dawnwing's Necrozma using 1000 Lunar fusion energy, 30 Necrozma candy and 30 Cosmo candy. Fusion will retain Necrozma IV set so make sure you find a good IV Necrozma. It will remain in fused state till we separate them in game. We can get Shiny Necrozma from these raids available with 120 Shiny Odd. Coming to PvP, it is not good in Ultra League but is a top meta pick in Master League PvP. Also in PvE, it is number one Ghost type raid attackers currently in the game and also among top 20 Psychic type raid attackers so don't miss it. Minimum 2 trainers with good level counters can beat it. Optimal lobby size is 3 to 5 trainers. Coming to top counters which we can use are Mega Tyranitar, Mega Gengar, Taro Tyranitar, Convinx Necrozma, Mega Bunnet, Taro Sandalio, Taro Gengar, Mega Houndoom, Tado Muto, Tyranitar, Hydrogen, Mega Gyarados, Blasphelon, Tado Weavile, Mega Absol, Darkrai, Tado Driplim, Tado Honchcrow, and Origin Giratina. So that is it for this raid guide. Good luck on your Hundo, Sundo, Shiny Hunt, and I will see you guys in the next video.